my name is Don Wei, I'm a researcher here at Packard. Yes, I'm Kevin Davis with Inside Software. Dallas is I work in the DTO R&D, the desktop organization. Uh, my name is David Huang, I'm with Phoenix Technologies. I'm Andrew Fish, I work for Apple. Or my name is Tim Lewis and I'm with Phoenix Technologies. I'm Ryan Kidwallader, I'm the on-site engineer for HP Laptops. Uh, my name is Paul Blitzer and I'm with AMD. Steven Gentili from Inside Software. Yeah, my name is Dong Gun Lee. Yeah, DJ, yeah, so from Samsung. Okay, my name is Michael Crown with Intel. Hey, my name is Jane Scott. I work at uh, PSG in the business notebook BIOS area. I'm a BIOS developer. I'm Jonathan Kellen. I'm with Seagate. What? Mark Jensen with Hewlett Packard. I'm with Kevin Berlin. I'm in the uh, workstation division for HP. My name is Brian Richardson. I'm a senior technical marketing engineer. I work at American Megatrends Incorporated. Uchida Hiroyuki is Lenovo de Hataraki. Uh, I'm Michael Johnson, I work for Phoenix Technologies. I'm Ken Taylor, I work for Phoenix Technologies. I'm Smith from Phoenix Technologies. I'm Dan Ellis from DisplayLink. Uh, my name is Bai Yi from Asus. Uh, my name is Edison. Uh, I am from Asus. I'm Kevin, I'm from Asus. My name is Nick Adams, uh, Asus Architect. Bailey Cross, uh, Intel. Uh, Mike Kenny Pickle. I am the uh, UEFI uh, new TWG chair, um, so I have been involved with all the previous platforms uh, responsible for getting people to test the uh, UEFI hardware and operating systems and uh, systems as well as uh, cards and software running on the system, so it's, it has been my uh, pleasure to have been involved with all the previous ones, and this is uh, uh, a much bigger one actually, <laughs> with all those, right. you know, the first one from Microsoft, and, uh, and you know, we've got 150 people here representing 78 plus companies, and that's a very much achievement uh, uh, oh, I love coming to PlugFest because it gives us a chance to, to get exposed to the latest technologies that are happening and we get a, a chance to, to run testing that's not available anywhere else. Well, we think it's important that, uh, you know, there's compatibility across the industry. Right. It's also a good way to, uh, for us at least, to meet vendors who are having issues that we don't even necessarily get to hear about. I came to this plug fest to support the many customers that are trying to make UEFI 2.3.1 systems. Uh, because UEFI is very important for our company in well, you know, for providing a new mechanism for firmware to support our platforms, and this is a big change in the industry. Uh, I came to the plug fest to, um, as a technical marketing board, to interact with customers and also a lot of other industry leaders for UEFI. And from a company standpoint, we're here to make sure we're getting the best device compatibility and testing for uh, the BIOS that we offer under UEFI. To uh, make sure that we were prepared for the launch um, and flesh out a lot of the bugs with our stuff and help our partners that are critical and getting their stuff ready to make sure their bugs are flushed out too. To try and test the 4K native sector size and to also look at testing the emulation uh, enterprise emulation solution also. As the host of the fall 2010 Plug Fest, naturally it was important for us to see success in, uh, in future Plug Fests. And uh, as an industry, we want to try to raise the bar each and every time we hold one of these events. And I think we can safely say that Microsoft has raised the bar in terms of the UEFI Plug Fest event with the Summer Plug Fest 2011. Because we are the industry IBB BIOS uh, vendor of the and we are fully support the UEFI for our firmware stack. I'm very excited actually. This is uh, like so a lot of companies are here. There's a lot of uh, new things that is, are discussed and uh, this is a transition that helps the industry a lot going forward to provide even better systems than today. Microsoft's support and sponsorship sends an important message to the entire industry about UEFI. Uh, just by evidence of the OEMs that are, that are here and some of the ODMs and people that traveled 
worldwide to be here on campus at Microsoft is clear that uh, Microsoft's involvement matters to the adoption, the transition, and the relevance of UEFI in our industry. You know, we didn't have all the time that we wanted to in terms of planning this event. Um, Tony, Microsoft stepped up and said, we think it's important, we think we should have one uh, in the summertime, and uh, the rest of the, uh, the industry communications working group stepped up alongside them and said, let's put it together. Uh, to have over 40 companies and uh, 175 people to, to show up here I think is, uh, is a testament to Microsoft's involvement. Uh, the facility is first rate, uh, the, the support staff that, that's here on site, it's an ideal location uh, to hold such an event. This has been a very interesting plug fest. I've been to several of the others. I think I'm wearing one of the, the original plug fest shirt. And uh, the turnout of this plug fest is just amazing. Uh, the number of companies, the uh, the number of companies, the number of people that are attending, the diversity of the people. Uh, there's a lot more energy at this plug fest too. There's just a lot of people um, asking more intelligent questions, more technical questions. It's like UEFI has arrived, and with this plug fest. Everybody has made that realization, and they're looking at it and saying, hey, we're here. And the fact that it's on Microsoft facilities, it also shows that you know, there's a commitment coming in from other big players in the industry, the software industry, particularly Microsoft, and that has, um, has also galvanized me by community saying, this is real, this is happening. And it's been a very positive experience in that regard. Um, there's, like I said, the, the plugging and the testing is happening now. Um, discussions about the new features and new technologies. The things that the, the legacy BIOS don't even think about because of it is just so far behind. Things like um, large drives, the 2.2 terabyte problem, which we've been talking about for years. <clears throat> this is the solution. This is where we're at. We're talking UEFI security, how to work with that. GOP, GOP drivers. I mean, all these technical innovations and solutions are now um, being talked about in the industry, and it's with a not if it happens, but when it happens, and how it's going to happen, and people want to play a part. In it. This has been a great plug fest. I've been coming to training events and plug fest since EBFI was EFI, kind of back in the infancy, and it's been a lot more direct interaction with people who are really doing development rather than people who are just learning about it for the first time. We have a lot of good test feedback from people. We're getting a lot of it really more, it feels like more mature questions on the subject. Uh, we're fixing more actual development problems than just doing a lot of basic education. So I think that shows that we're making a lot of progress. Um, so far it's been great. We've uh, already had several bugs. We've uh, made, uh, well, there's been a lot of training uh, and more importantly some uh, meetings, just you know, one-on-one -on -one interactions that we we're able to have with critical partners that uh, probably couldn't have happened any other way. Uh, some of which involved having three, you know, multiple different, you know, at least three parties involved, and that's been very helpful. Uh, it's been good so far. Uh, I think you get really good attendance. Uh, got a good uh, spectrum of all the different UEFI vendors, BIOS vendors, and customers. So it, it's been interesting and very fruitful. To get a chance to talk to everybody. I think this preface is really successful because we met with all the ecosystem, the OS vendor, the IHV vendor, and all the OE and OD and ecosystem, and we're doing great. We receive all the good information, we work with everybody in the ecosystem, try to help the whole ecosystem fully ready for the next generation of UEFI spec. We fully believe it's a great usage of our engineers' time, we fry everybody important people to hear, to work with the ecosystem, and it actually works very well with us and with our customer. We do a lot of progress, uh, solving the problem, uh, move ahead, resolve all the compatibility issues. So we strongly believe this trip is fully uh, worth the trip. So this is probably one of the busiest UEFI plug fests that I've attended in the last few years. There seem to be more things going on. There seems to be uh, more testing happening at this plug fest. And some of the presentations have just been a lot better this time.